Before you start advertising on Facebook, you want to know who you are advertising to. So for that, what you could do is use one of Facebook's amazing tools. Uh, what I'm looking at right now, I'm at um, my ad manager page on Facebook. And you just go to tools and go to audience insights. So you could get lots of information about your audience on this page here. And what you would want to do is go to interests and type in your keywords or a public figure in the niche that you are marketing to. Um, so for this example, uh, let's say I am marketing to people who want to make money, who want to make money online or to people who want to start a business online. Um, so let's just choose just a general keyword here. I'm just gonna to go to business and industry and I'm just gonna to go to this right here, just choose entrepreneurship. Okay, and so just looking at the data here, uh, for the gender, you can see that it is evenly split. It's 50% women, 50% men um, that you are targeting to. And you can see their age range here. Uh, the majority of the men that you are marketing to here on Facebook are going to be in the age range of 25 to 34. Whereas for women, it's going to be in this age range right here, 35 to 44. But you can safely say that your the age range that you are talking your marketing to is between 25 and 54 years old okay and you could also look at their lifestyle um, if you put your the mouse over the, the eye here you can get more information uh, for example here it says solo and stable are singles and homeowners who work in mainly white collar professional administrative and managerial jobs their education and income place them above average in the middle class so you get an idea here that um, your market the people you're marketing to um, have white collar jobs or homeowners and are singles um, here metro mix it says here the middle incomes urban tenants okay um, so you could just keep going down relationship status, education level. Uh, you see that 61% have some college education and the job titles. You could see a lot of them are in management, production, okay. And you could also click on these other tabs here. Um, well, right now I'm just looking at demographics, but you can also go to the page likes and see what they have liked on Facebook. You can see the top categories here. Uh, you can see page likes. Okay, the most relevant pages that they have liked. You can see the most relevant one here is Brendan Bouchard. Um, so you could you know, target people who like Brendan Bouchard. Okay, now let's go to activity. You can see what um, activities they've done on Facebook. Um, you can see that ads clicked, it says right here, ads clicked 43. Let's um, just bring up that. It says selected audience 43 people on Facebook. So um, compared to other people on Facebook, you can see in the, in the gray shade here, and then you look at uh, your audience, the, the people who are interested in business, you see that, you know, here in the blue, the blue color here, um, you know, there's a lot, there's a great proportion of them compared to the people, uh, other people on Facebook that click on ads. So you know that these people uh, do like to click on Facebook ads. And you can see that here again, they, they like posts, uh, they, they also, a lot more of them had comments compared to uh, people outside of your target market. Okay, and you can see here device users. 
see, 25% use Android, 55% mobile only, desktop. So you see that a lot of them, um, you know, actually like to use mobile devices. Uh, you can see, you know, a lot, a fewer, fewer of them actually use an actual computer than the majority of people on Facebook. Okay, you can also go to a household uh, to get an idea of what their income is. You see the majority of them are between 50 to 75,000. And again, here you can see the majority of them are homeowners. As for the household size, the number of adults and children who live in a single US home, you can see that the majority of them are singles. There's just one person that lives in the home. And you can also see their spending methods. And you can also go here and see their purchases.